Hi, y'all. Welcome back to Life According to Squirrel. You know, I will be 528 months old in October. This October. Yep, 528 months old. Do y'all realize how, how silly that sounds? By telling somebody how old you are in months? Um, I was thinking about that. I don't understand why we call kids ages in months up to a certain age and then we switch to years and then it's years and, and partials and quarters and, and halves and wholes. Um, but I don't understand why. If you're zero to one, I understand months because you're, you're zero. How old, how old is your baby? My baby is zero. That just sounds silly. Right? Just, it just sounds silly. Um, but if they're one, they're one. If they're two, they're two. If they're three, they're three. I, I, I just never, never understood it. I've always found it to be silly. Um, I don't round up <laughs> typically my age. Um, at a certain point in a woman's life, uh, we tend to, uh, to round down by keeping it at the whole number of the date of our birth. You know, that, that's kind of what we do. So I think that we need to just simplify the processing and the rules behind why we why we we go by months and then and then years and then quarters and then halves and wholes and then back to uh, if you're if you're zero to one it's months if, if you've hit one it's just years but uh, makes sense it's just silly. It's just silly. It's just silly because, um, like I said, five. I'm right now. I'm how old are you, ma'am? I'm five hundred twenty-seven and a half months old. Super proud of that. Silly. Think about it. Just think about it. That's all I'm asking you to do. Think about it. All right, y'all. Have a good day. Thanks for watching.